Hey peeps, I thought I was just about to sit down and do a video on how to do piping and I was setting up the machine to do it and I thought, you know what, seeing I've got this brother F420 set up to do the piping demonstration, I would do a quick video first of all on how cool this machine is so I can pop it on the website. So brother F420 is one of my favorite model machines. It's a little bit of a sleeper model. People don't really pay it much attention. It doesn't have all the bells and whistles of the bigger machines, but it has a really nice range of good, sturdy, everyday functions that are lacking maybe on some of the smaller machines. Price point on this one, I think the recommended retail is $12.99. It's at that price point, there's not a lot of competition on the market, I think, that will stack up to this machine. Let me show you a couple of things why. First of all, Oh, it is a very solid machine, very sturdy build machine with quite a wide sewing area. So a little bit wider than your normal machine, but not big, big like a quilting machine. So as an all-rounder, got a lot of space for everything. It has a really nice top loading bobbin, good accessory box with bits and pieces stored underneath that then comes off and gives you a really nice long free arm for doing things like you know, jeans and sleeves and stuff like that. Let's talk nitty gritty as far as using the machine is concerned. Let's thread it first of all. So for threading this machine, the best thing about most brother machines will be the needle threader. This series of needle threader is automatic. So threading is very straightforward as far as, you know, it's a process you'll be familiar with, up, down, up, down. When we get to here, thread goes in above the needle foot goes down, thread goes into the automatic needle threader and pull that needle thread down and boom, that needle is threaded. So I could do it with my eyes shut. Look, I'll show you, I'll do it again. Up into here, shut my eyes, needle's threaded. See, pretty cool. Um, so that's your automatic needle threader. On this F series and upwards, that needle threader is fully automatic, so it's really, really cool. Uh, now, next thing about this is the actual stitch selection and mechanism, uh, sorry, and uh, screen over here. So you have this nice LCD screen that shows you what's going on. And then a huge range of stitches, which are up here, see them? Here, that you will input onto the screen. So quick selection for everyday stitches. When you choose the stitch, it shows you the stitch on the screen, tells you the foot that you need, shows you the width and length settings that then you can change with the touch of a button. And those changes, you can actually keep if you want so that every time you go back to the stitch, that change has saved. Very handy for patchworkers, so you can take that standard straight stitch, give it a stitch length of 1.8, which we like because it doesn't come undone so easily, and then save it so that every time you go back to that stitch, it keeps that saving. Pretty cool. Um, you can do lettering. Oop. Yes, I don't want that one anymore. I'm gonna do some lettering instead. So you have fonts that are either block, curly, or open letter, type it in, and, oh, I wonder if I get, oh, couldn't get a word by just guessing, but that lettering will now just stitch out. So it's very simple to use. Functions of the machine, variable speed control, so you can maximize, set a max speed for how you wanna sew. Uh, stop with the needle in the up down position, reverse, lock off stitch and one of my fave things is a scissor function so let's see how it sews it's a nice bright fabric to match my nice bright gloves now also a knee lift can't really see it in the picture here but there's a knee lift that comes with this machine so you can plug it into the front of the machine and use your knee to lift the foot up and down so you don't have to take your hands off your work ready steady uh, oh we push it to do a straight stitch so normal stitch menu straight stitch uh, 1.8 because that's how I set it and saved it. Let's do it. So maximum speed So you see nice and smooth Stops with the needle in the down position if I want the needle to go up press this button If I want the needle to go down press the same button now that I'm finished scissors and That thread has been cut for me automatically uh, now one other feature just to finish up because I want this to be a quick video is these buttons here automatic reverse and automatic cut function so that means regardless of what stitch i choose so let's choose uh, just a, a trico stitch three step zigzag when i hit my foot on the pedal it automatically locks off for me so it's doing a knot it gets stuck into the stitch and then when i get to where i need to be with my foot still on the pedal if i want i just hit that reverse button my foot's still on the pedal it'll knot the stitch off for me 
and cut it all automatically because I have these buttons turned on. Awesome machine. I think best in the market at that price point. If you're thinking about upgrading to a bigger machine, but you don't want to spend tons and tons of money. I think anyone with aspirations for quilting, patchworking, dressmaking, bag making, this is a great all-rounder for you to think about. If you want to have a look at it, we keep one in the store so you can have a demo on it. If you want to order one, we order them directly from Brother and it takes about five days to get here. Okay, I'm going to go.